Testosterone is an androgen, a hormone found in both men and women. Men have higher levels of testosterone than women, and it plays a crucial role in men's health. While testosterone is often connected with libido and sexual performance, it also affects much more important areas of a man's health. Muscle mass and bone density are all regulated by testosterone. Like any hormone, testosterone can be subject to highs and lows, and this can have a serious impact on our bodies. Let's take a look at some of the natural treatments for low testosterone. 1. Healthy Weight Loss Conditions such as obesity and diabetes can contribute to low testosterone levels. In fact, middle-aged, overweight men are most likely to develop diabetes and low testosterone levels. Losing excess weight and maintaining a healthy weight is a good way to quickly boost your testosterone level. Of course, this doesn't mean you need to start hitting the gym for several hours a day. A healthy diet and moderate exercise should be enough to keep you in shape. Eating properly and taking enough exercise also helps to boost testosterone levels. If you're struggling with your weight, why not consult a doctor or nutritionist to come up with an action plan for weight loss? 2. Good sleep There's no getting around it. Sleep is essential to health. Getting enough good quality sleep is recommended for dealing with just about every health condition available, usually alongside other lifestyle changes and treatments. Most adults need at least 8 hours of sleep per night, but it's important that you get unbroken quality sleeping time. Each individual's needs vary, so it's important to get the right amount of sleep for you personally, whether it's more or less than the recommended amount. Sleep is necessary for our bodies to rest and rejuvenate. Poor sleep has been connected to low testosterone levels in some men. It can also exacerbate underlying illnesses. 3. Exercise now it's time to mention everybody's least favorite topic, exercise. Whether we like it or not, the simple fact is that exercise boosts our mood. It stimulates brain chemicals, leading us to feel refreshed, energetic, and happier. Even something as simple as a brisk walk can clear our heads, boost our mood, and leave us feeling better than before. Testosterone levels also tend to rise after a period of exercise, you may not feel particularly compelled to exercise, especially if you've been suffering from low testosterone for some time. This is because low testosterone levels may leave you feeling weak and unmotivated. If you suffer from obesity or poor mobility, exercise can be problematic. However, you can start small and work up gradually. Even a 30-minute brisk walk a day is a great start. Try and pick a form of exercise you personally enjoy and stick with it. Exercise can also help to shed excess weight. Obesity or too much excess weight can contribute to lowering your testosterone level. Of course, it's important to maintain a good diet at the same time. Exercise and diet go hand in hand when it comes to weight loss and balancing testosterone levels. 4. Low Sugar Diets Our bodies work on a precariously balanced cocktail of hormones, testosterone included. A dip or a rise in one hormone may cause tangible effects in our bodies. Something as basic as a poor diet can throw our hormones out of balance and leaves us reaping the consequences. To keep our hormones regulated, we need to fill our bodies with the proper amount of vitamins. This means eating good food. Junk food and processed food tend to be high in calories and shockingly low in protein and vitamins. Additionally, high glucose levels may actually contribute to low testosterone levels and even affect sex drive. So if you're concerned about low testosterone levels, trying a low-sugar diet could actually work well for you. Aside from cutting out sugar, there are certain foods known to boost testosterone production. Let's take a brief look at some of the best foods you can eat to combat low T levels. Milk Milk is rich in calcium and vitamin D. It strengthens bones and can also work to boost testosterone. However, milk can be extremely fattening. If you have health concerns about drinking too much milk, try opting for a low-fat option. It should still have all the vital nutrients without any excess fat. Tuna Tuna is a healthy choice for any diet. It's rich in vitamin D and protein and also nourishes heart health. 
Canned tuna is often cheap, meaning that you can get the vitamins you need without breaking the bank. Tuna counts as seafood, and according to human dietary requirements, you should have two to three servings per week. However, don't be tempted to overdo it. Mercury can be found in seafood, so moderation is important. Fortified cereals and whole grains. Whole grain bread is known to be much healthier than cheaper white alternatives. Fortified cereals also contain vitamin D, which is handy for promoting heart health and testosterone production. When you can, go for a whole grain option instead of a white bread alternative. Egg yolks. Egg yolks are particularly rich in vitamin D, but they're not recommended for anyone suffering from high cholesterol. However, if you don't have high cholesterol, one egg a day can help to boost low T levels. Some seafood. Salmon, sardines, crab, oysters, lobster, and more are all rich in zinc. Since zinc deficiencies are linked to low testosterone production, eating two or three servings of seafood a week can go a long way towards promoting testosterone levels. Red meat. Meats such as beef are high in iron and vitamin D, which makes them handy for boosting testosterone production. However, beware, eating too much red meat has been linked to bowel and colon cancers. It can also cause heart disease and cholesterol problems. If you choose to eat red meat, only eat lean cuts of meat to minimize animal fats. Avoid processed meats like sausages, bacon, and ham. 5. Zinc Zinc is an essential nutrient, especially for men with low testosterone. In fact, zinc deficiencies are often linked to low testosterone levels. You can use zinc supplements if you prefer, but the best way to get any vitamin is naturally through your diet. Foods rich in zinc include nuts, beans, etc., whole grains, red meat, poultry, some kinds of seafood like oysters, crab, and lobster. Once again, it's a good idea to speak to a doctor if you're concerned about a zinc deficiency. Dietary and lifestyle changes can only go so far, while eating a healthy diet, getting plenty of exercise, and sleeping well are all essential to good health, you may need a little extra help, especially if you're suffering from hypogonadism. You may need to seek medical attention. A doctor can properly confirm that you have low testosterone levels via a blood test, then the doctor can prescribe treatments. They may also recommend lifestyle changes, especially if you're suffering from obesity or eating a poor diet. Testosterone hormone replacements could be prescribed to treat your low testosterone levels. Testosterone replacement therapy is a much more direct way of dealing with the signs and symptoms of poor levels of testosterone. The dangers of testosterone therapy are in the side effects. Your doctor will discuss these side effects with you. Prolonged use of hormone replacements could leave your body reliant on these treatments. Testosterone replacement therapy can actually lead to your body producing less testosterone than before. While this will treat the symptom, it will not deal with the root cause. Testosterone therapy may also increase red blood cell count and even decrease sperm production and fertility. Testosterone hormone replacement treatment could come in the form of pills, injections, or gels. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and don't forget to give this video the thumbs up. And I'm sure you're going to enjoy our next video on how to increase your white blood cells fast. Thanks for watching and bye for now.